Hello everyone, Pixeled Monk here, and welcome to an old school RuneScape guide showing you how to complete the quest, The Hand in the Sand. This quest is considered intermediate difficulty and is medium length, about 20 minutes long. The requirements for this quest include 17 thieving and 49 crafting, which is not boostable. The required items for this quest include a regular beer, 150 coins, two empty vials, red berries, white berries, lantern lens, five earth runes, bucket of sand. This is obtainable in the quest, just make sure you bring an empty bucket. Although not required, it is highly recommended that you also have ring of dueling, amulet of glory, weight reducing gear such as graceful gear, stamina or super energy potions, Ardoin teleports, home teleports set for Yanil or watchtower teleports. There are some maps in the description below that help you to identify some of the key points of this quest. Open it up to keep it handy. You start the quest by first going to Yanil. The easiest way to get there is by using the minigame teleport to Nightmare Zone, by using a home teleport if set for Yanil, or by using a watchtower teleport. Once there, find and talk to Bert. He is located in the building east of the house portal. When prompted, say, Ew, a hand in the sand. Why haven't you told the authorities? And, Sure, I'll give you a hand. Bert will give you a hand. If you need sand for your bucket, it is located just north of the house portal. Walk directly south into the Ye Old Dragon Inn. Talk to the guard captain. He will take the beer and hand and turn it into a beer soaked hand. Now go to the Wizards Guild, which is just to the east. Ring the bell just outside of the guild and Savistic Rarv will appear. Or, if you're 66 magic, walk inside and talk to him. When prompted, say, I have a rather sandy problem that I'd like to palm off you. Use this prompt every time you talk to him. You will give him the hand. Now you'll need to go back to Bert. He'll give you a copy of his work schedule. Afterwards, you'll have to go to Brimhaven. The easiest way to get there is by using an Ardoin teleport and then walking south to the docks. Right click on Captain Barnaby and choose the pay fare option. You will now be in Brimhaven. Cross the gangplank and walk to a small building that is just northwest of the bar to find Sandy. Once there, search Sandy's desk to get Bert's old schedule. Read both schedules. Next, pickpocket Sandy. This may take several attempts, but you should receive sand. Now you'll need to go back to Bert. Either use a home teleport, a ring of dueling to Castle Wars and then walk east to Yanil, or a watchtower teleport. Talk to Bert and he'll give you a scroll. Go to the Wizards Guild again and ring the bell to talk to Savistic Rarv. He'll give you a magical orb. Afterwards, talk to him again and say, can you help me more? 
and yes, that would be great. He will teleport you to the magic shop in Port Serum. Talk to Betty, who is inside of the shop. When prompted, say, talk to Betty about the hand in the sand. She will give you bottled water. Use your red berries on the bottle of water. Then the white berries. This will make pink dye. Use it on the lantern lens to make rose tinted lens. Talk to Betty again. Afterwards, step into the open doorway of the building. Use the rose tinted lens on the counter in the center of the room. This will make a truth serum. Talk to Betty again and she will take the sand from your inventory. Now you'll need to go back to Sandy in Brimhaven. Use your Ardoin teleport and take the boat to Brimhaven. Once there, talk to Sandy. When prompted, say, but the pygmy shrews have eaten all the sand. When he looks out the window, use the truth serum on his coffee, which is located just west of the door on a small table. If he doesn't look out the window, try the other prompts. Once complete, left click on the magical orb in your inventory to activate it and talk to Sandy. When prompted, choose all the options. Why is Bert's Rota different from the original? Why doesn't Bert remember the change in hours? And what happened to the wizard? Afterwards, go back to Yanil and talk to Sophistic Rarv at the Wizards Guild. Talk to him again and a cutscene will occur. He will take the bucket of sand and the earth runes. Now you'll need to go to Entrana. So be sure to bank any kind of weapons and armor, which is just east of the Wizard's Guild. The easiest way to get to Entrana is by using an Amulet of Glory to drain her village and walking to the Port Serum docks. Once there, right click on one of the monks and select the Take Boat option. You will now be on Entrana. Cross the gangplank and walk west to the sand pit. Talk to Mazian. He will give you a head. Now you'll have to go back to Yanil and talk to Sophistic Rarv again to complete the quest. Congratulations, you have received one quest point, 1,000 thieving experience, 9,000 crafting experience, and a secret reward from Bert. You can receive up to 84 buckets of sand by talking to him once daily. This will depend on your completion of the Ardoin Diary. Thank you so much for watching. I hope that you enjoyed this guide and found it helpful. If you did, please subscribe for more and I'll see you next time.